Imagine waking up and having this surge of excitement because you've just manifested 24K overnight doing something you love and suddenly it's easy to pay your bills, save some extra money and even like organize a fun travel trip or go to a spa hotel, like a five-star luxury spa hotel. Well, that's exactly what happened to me when I manifested 24K overnight. And in this video, I want to show you how I did it and what manifestation technique I used to get there and make this my reality. And I know it sounds unbelievable, but stick with me because I promise you, you will be able to do something similar, if not the same. Let me tell you the story, how it actually happened and what I did. I was back then an artist. I just quit my job. I sold pieces already for a few thousand dollars, but that month was really different because I actually wrote down very specifically how much I want to make in two months. It was 40K, okay? So on one point, I made my plan, I did massive action, and on one point, suddenly this woman writes me a message and says, hey, do you still have this one painting? And I actually had a conversation with her, I think two weeks ago, and I asked her if she would be interested in an artwork, and she said no, and she laughed. And she changed the topic. But literally, she came back two weeks later and asked me if the, you know, if the painting is still available. I said, yes. She asked me for the price. I said, 24K. And she bought it. Crazy. I know. It, it is insane. And believe me, I haven't sold anything near 24K. But I was clear what I wanted. And I'm going to show you now what I use, what's the technique I use, and how you can do the same. Okay, so stick with me. We'll explain it in a moment. So the technique that I actually used, I call it GDDMO. I know it sounds funny, but let me explain you what it means. So G is for goal. First of all, you need to set a very clear goal, and that's exactly what I did. I had my goal 40K within two months. And by the way, in another video, I talked about belief. It's very, very important that you actually believe you can achieve this goal. So I had the goal 40K. I had the date, which is one of the Ds, is have a clear date, which was for me two months from now when I set the goal. Then the other D stands for decide. That's exactly what I did. I decided that this is going to happen and this is it. You know, this is my goal. This is the date. So what that means, after you decide, you don't go back and forth. You don't doubt it. You don't think about, hmm, maybe this is too much. I've never done anything close. Maybe I should put the goal a bit down. You know, nothing. None of that. Decision means you decided it's done. You cut out any other opportunity, any other possibilities, right? So it's very important. And I think in the manifestation space, that's what many people just get wrong. Right? They put lots of dreams out there, vision board, this and that, but they never really decide on what they want, right? Because they want just everything and like many things and change their minds all the time. So that's why I do it differently and why this worked for me, because I made this decision, right? So goal, date, decision, and what's the rest? Maybe you can guess. It's M-O and M stands for massive action. And O stands for outcome, but basically means detachment from outcome. So if you put everything together, you have the goal, very clear goal. You have a date. You decided. So this is it. You're not going back and forth anymore. You're not rethinking your goal. And then also you take massive action. And for the massive action, I want to talk about this quickly before we go to the next one. I made a plan. I really wrote down my goal, when I want to have it, and then decided that's it, period. There's no back and forth. And then the massive action plan, which was for me like really doing a lot. So I was not just sitting at home and just visualizing it. I was like taking massive action because that's another thing in the manifestation space which people get wrong. They think like you literally just think about it and you feel, you know, you feel amazing. And yes, things start happening for sure. But also action. Action is already a manifestation of your thoughts and your emotions, right? Because all of this is energy. And if, you, if your thoughts and emotions are aligned with what you want, you will want to take action. You won't have resistance, right? So that's already a manifestation of you doing the, the process right. And then I know that when you take action, right? If you're working on something, what are you focusing on? You focus on this thing, right? Especially if you have your goals very, very clear and you know why you're doing that. If you take a massive action, but you constantly think about doubt, then it's not going to work. Stop doing the action because it's anyways not going to work. But I was completely aligned. And then I took massive action. Then I also knew. So not just taking action, but massive action, because in my mind, it increased my belief that I can get it. Because I knew if I take massive action and do as much as possible and really give my best, it will increase the chances of me getting that. So I did that. I had my plan and I felt really confident and actually very excited. And then 
the outcome, the detachment of the outcome is very important too. And I think that goes hand in hand with the decision. So when you decide it, you forget about the goal actually. What you're focusing on is on the action. You take massive action and you're not worried about, worried about the outcome. And so the first month I made 30,000. The first month, my goal was 40,000 within two months. And already the first month, I was over 50% of my goal in two months. How can you do the same now? It's very simple. Do the same like I did. First, decide on a very specific goal. What do you want to achieve? And this is specifically about money. Because if you want money, you need to want money, right? So what do you want? How much money do you want to manifest? That's the first thing. Ask yourself this. And you can even write it down now with this video. How much money do you want to manifest? That's number one. Number two. In what time frame? What's the date from now? And very, very important with both the goal and the time frame, pick a goal you can believe in. And also a time frame that actually supports the belief that you can get it. Because if, let's say, you've never made 10,000 a month, but now your goal is to make 100,000 in one month. Be very honest with yourself. Do you really believe you can do that? If yes, perfect, go ahead. If not, if you're honest with yourself and you say, no, I don't really believe in that. So, well, do you believe in it if you would say two years from now? You say, yes, I can imagine that. Yes, I can. But two years is way too far. You don't want to set a goal that's two years because then you know, you, you're not going to do a massive action plan for two years. So it has to be something that's kind of short term, but still gives you enough space to believe you can achieve your goal. So let's say your goal is 10,000 in one month that's that's doable maybe it's ten thousand in two months if this is something that feels good to you and you believe in then go with that okay and it's important with the time frame that it's something that's between like one or three months because you can see yourself taking massive action in one or three months and commit to a goal if it feels comfortable for you maybe you can also do six months but that's just what works for me right two months worked really well for me one month seemed a bit short term like it was, oh, I don't have enough time here. It's just like 30 days. But 60 days felt like, yeah, I have some time there. And a lot of successful companies, they actually always work in quarters. So they set quarterly goals. So they might also maybe be something that works for you. You have the goal, you have the time frame. So set it now. Hopefully you have something. If not, stop the video and think about it and write it down. And then the third step. Once you have it, and I highly recommend you do this after watching this video. Because now you have the chance. I'm here to motivate you and basically also give you permission to set a financial goal and commit to it, right? Because after you watch this video, you go to another video and another video and you completely forgot about this exercise. But if you're serious about making money and manifesting a large sum, sum of money in a short period of time, you have to do this exercise. So you have your goal, you have your time frame, and then you have to decide. You have to decide. I want you to decide after this video is done. Or like take 50 minutes time after you watch this video and then do this exercise and decide. You have to decide. Without the decision, it's not going to work because you will go back and forth. You will doubt. You will ask your friends or talk about it with your friends. And they put doubt in you and not going to work. You have to really decide. Okay. And then it's this decision really means you decided. There's just no, no overthinking, no, you know, going back and forth, no doubt, nothing. Because all these things just come when you didn't decide for something and then when you decided make a massive action plan what are you gonna do to get there and the funny thing is I actually haven't executed fully on my massive action plan actually not even like I've done not nearly as much as I said because I had the plan I felt really confident and then I was in the right space you know I was in the right energy to receive that much money because there was no way I could have put that into my massive action plan that the woman is going to reach out to me that I talked with two weeks ago and suddenly wants to buy a piece for 24,000 there's no chance I could have planned that so also when you make your massive action plan always be very open to the universe and what opportunities the universe gives you but the massive action plan it's it's releasing even more energy because it also shows the universe that you're really 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 serious okay and then you work on the ma massive action plan because that also helps you to not go back to the goal and think about the goal and the how no you you basically have the how and as i said the funny thing is often it happens differently than you think but it helps helps you to focus on something and not start worrying or getting distracted or, or overthinking or doubting because that will just you know push your manifestation away so it's important that you're very focused and you're dialed in that's why i do all these steps and then the last one is yeah detachment from the outcome if you do that 
you're going to do well, you're going to manifest a lot of money, and it depends on what you believe you can receive, right? That's very, very important, because I cannot promise you what you can receive. It's not up to me. It's in your consciousness. Whatever you believe you can receive is what you will get, okay? Very important. So yeah, and the detachment of the outcome basically also comes with making the decision and having the massive action plan and just focusing on executing. Because, you know, doing action will help you to not think about the outcome. It's very simple. Okay, anyways, I hope it helps. This is what I did. It's the GDDMO method. And it works powerfully. It works incredibly well. So that's how I did it. But in the end of the day, none of this will really work if you are not aligned with the frequency of who you want to be. Because oftentimes we, we want something that's out there, but we are like here, our personality, our frequency is here and what we want is there. So everything I just told you won't work if your frequencies are not aligned. So make sure to watch this video, it's somewhere in the description, to align your frequency with what you want, to become what you want, because that's what you need to do. Then you you literally, you vibrate in the same frequency like what you want. And this was, I already did that. I was vibrating in the right frequency. If I wouldn't, I wouldn't have got what I wanted. So I wouldn't have manifested that much money. It's very important. So make sure to watch the video wherever it is, like down below, left, right, center. And then I see you in the next video. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you did the exercise down in the comments and we'll talk soon.